It's that time of the month once again where I get a hunch that there could be a brand new update on the horizon for Path of Titans as well as two other things that I want to talk about in this video as some stuff that I don't think will fit into a news video unless they release sometime soon so we're going to talk about them as well. Timestamps for everything are on the screen now and if you are new feel free to subscribe but let's get into why I think a new update is coming to the game soon as well as some other stuff. I think we've found a pattern that could indicate that there will be an update in September. Now, I want to tell this before I go into this discussion. This is a discussion, not really any information that an uh, update is coming out this month. However, bear that in mind. There's no confirmation from the developers. I'm not the paragon of hope where it's like, whatever I say comes true. No, that will not happen. You know, if I'm saying I think there's something coming out, that's a thought. I don't know as much uh, you know, as everyone thinks. I literally know the same amount as you guys. I'm just putting piece and piece together. However, when you think about it, the last two dinosaurs that were released, Amargosaurus and Tyrannosaurus, were released two months apart from each other. Amargosaurus was released in May, the back end of May, the final week of May on a Wednesday, and Tyrannosaurus was also released two months later in July, the final week of July. How do I know this? Well, every month, May and July, I had a holiday in the final week of that month. And each holiday, a new dinosaur was released. Now, we are lucky that I don't have a holiday in September, so that could mean the curse is finally broken, or the developers realise that I'm on holiday next week and then release the update. And I really hope that does not happen. That being said, I think that since it's been two months since the July Tyrannosaurus Rex update, there will be an update at the final week of September, and I think it will release on Wednesday. The reason why I say that is because both of the other two dinosaurs also released on a Wednesday, and midweek seems to be a nice update pattern for the game. That being said, why do I think there is something coming apart from that hunch? Well, to put it simply, the game's been pretty silent lately, and that indicates that they are working on some updates. I'd say or suggest that in the next week or so, we could start seeing a trickle of information over on the PTB. That being said, there was also a since deleted comment on the game's Instagram page that kind of indicates an accidental slip up with the marketing team. On the post that was titled Summer in the Park Vibes, there was a comment that read, when are you adding a dino? The Instagram account, Path of Titans' official Instagram account, replied with this. With the season change, a new update soon. And as many of you know, we're coming to the end of August now, or the end of summer. The last dinosaur was released in summer. We could be seeing a dinosaur every season. Amargosaurus came in spring. Tyrannosaurus came in summer, the start of summer. And now we're seeing the end of summer and potentially a new dinosaur. And as most of you know... I think it's the same in the whole world or the whole of the Northern Hemisphere, but in the UK, the day that autumn starts, or fall for you Americans, is the 22nd of September, which gives us the final week of the month being the season change time of the year, or month in a sense. However, don't get too excited just yet, because Matt kind of squished this. He was asked if there was an actual update coming, but he said this. No update, and if there was news about an upcoming update, we would post it everywhere. Which is interesting, because the only time they've actually posted the news of an upcoming update everywhere was a massive update, like growth. And, of course, Xbox release. I think, actually, no, I don't even think they've done it for growth. I think they only done it for console release because it was a big one. And they had to have a pre-release kind of thing so you could pre-order the game. That being said, they haven't really pre-announced updates. They just happen. Or you get an update and then sometime the week after, a dinosaur is randomly just revealed. That being said, I do hope that there is a dinosaur update this month. And I think it could be Picno, mainly because that's the dinosaur that I've been wanting to see for quite some time now and I feel like it's probably the most complete out of them all. That being said we'll have to wait and see and of course who knows maybe Matt's telling the truth and there won't be an update this month or maybe Matt's just covering the scent of the trail to get us off his tail. That being said I'd love to know your thoughts do you think a new update is coming this month do you think it's coming at the back end of this month I'm predicting let's have a look at my calendar I'm predicting Wednesday the 28th 
or Wednesday the 21st. We could also see an update that releases on Sunday the 25th or Monday the 26th, which will be just a change log of random stuff, and then we could see the update on the Wednesday after that, where a dinosaur is just revealed, like the pattern of the previous update. Anyways, guys, let me know your thoughts about that. I'd love to know. And of course, up next, Anodontosaurus is cancelled. Yes, it, it's cancelled. Anodontosaurus was clearly trending on Twitter for its heinous crimes of being too thick and being my favourite dinosaur in the game. Is it back? Is it no longer cancelled? I mean, a quick check indicates that it's still gone and... Anodontosaurus shows no sign of returning anytime soon. Essentially, Anodontosaurus was temporarily disabled from the official servers of the game, but you can still play the dinosaur on community servers. So if you have the game on, or if you'd have the dinosaur on official servers and you can't see it in your character select menu or play it at all, that is why. If you had an Anodontosaurus on the official servers, it will probably come back when it's re-released into the game. But why was it removed? Well, you see, Anodontosaurus is a dirty hacker. It hacked into the Alderon Games mainframe. It hacked over Matt's Discord account, renamed it to Anodontosaurus Supreme, and then it gave itself an exploit. That exploit essentially meant that the Fortify ability or the Hunker Down ability was still enabled when you were uncrouched, which essentially made you invincible or immortal for a until someone could finally crack you or a whole horde of dinosaurs could crack you and that allowed it to run around kill whatever it wanted without any you know problems and it would just camp home caves as well and it was not fun at all so anodontosaurus was removed because of that and they're aiming to fix it and they said it will be re-released once the patch has been made for this dinosaur and they figured out the problem we don't know when it's going to come back but poor anodontosaurus it was too good for its own Good. And now it's it's in the shadow realm waiting for Matt and Jiggy to give it the forgiveness that it really needs. Let's hope it gets it soon. Can we get hashtag pray for Anodonto in the comments? That would be great. And the final thing that's coming in a future update and is being tested on the PTB at the moment is proximity chat. This is proximity voice chat and it's a weird one because it is something that the devs did want in the game and they have planned for the game in the future and this was something we knew about last year and the, I think the year before that, I'm not too sure. But that being said, it's an interesting one. Walking around, going near a dinosaur, hearing someone talking, it's interesting. It's not something that you see in dinosaur games, but I'm here for it, you know. I actually quite like it. That being said, it's on the PTB right now. You can go and give it a test. I haven't tested it just yet. However, I've heard that it's a little rough around the edges. Of course, this is an early build of the proximity chat, so don't expect this to be the final product of it but yeah it's interesting because will it be peaceful or will you be hearing people go in goblin mode when they die or get attacked by some dinosaurs it's going to open up for an interesting dynamic and an interesting gameplay type let me know your thoughts about that if you go over into the ptb you can hop over onto the ptb now and test it with some friends and yeah it does make me wonder will this be something that comes in that major update that will add a new dinosaur who knows one can only hope but i doubt it will be coming and that being said, everybody, that's everything I wanted to talk about in this video. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Love to know what you think, as always. But yeah, other than that, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you are new, feel free to subscribe. But other than that, I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day. Peace.